What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit up my sponsor, SafeNBAMT.com. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout and stop getting scammed by NBA 2K's pack odds. Hit them up right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back. And today, we are going over the market as per usual. And, um, yeah, I was trying to stream before. I literally was trying to stream, but my internet is so garbage. I don't know what's going on. I think it's because of the weather. My internet has never done this before. I've never had issues with my internet in general. And literally, I don't know what's going on. I guess Fios is out of my area. But, yo, guys, today is a very sad day. It's one year since Kobe and Gigi died, bro. Um, prayers up to them, bro. Prayers up to their family. It was tough, man. I remember when that first happened, bro. It was crazy, man. Especially as a 2K YouTuber. It's insane. But, man, prayers up to them. We're going to talk about the market. It's, we got a lot to talk about, man. We are talking about a lot, a lot of stuff. My internet is bugging in general. So everything I show you, it's probably going to be a little slower. I have no idea what's going on in my area, but it's pissing me off so bad. I don't know what to do. I guess there's a Fios outage. I, I, I can't even record this video at this point. Um, everything is just beyond slow. I don't even know what's going on, man. I have no idea. Alrighty, finally the internet is back. Supposedly, we're gonna see how it goes, man. Um, but um, yeah. If you guys are new, man, like it up, sub it up, all that good stuff. If you not need to buy in your and or sell your MT, make sure to hit me up on Instagram and Twitter. I am buying and selling MT. Um, but uh, yeah, we're gonna go over the market, man. This video is gonna probably be shorter. I'm very pissed right now. Like I'm super heated. I took a shower, came back. Flows there? No, I'm just kidding. I'm just so annoyed because the internet is literally it was pissing me off i was gonna stream but now i can't stream i had i had a time bro i had to stream at this certain time and now i can't so maybe we'll stream later i'm very pissed off right now i know it's I'm very very pissed off so we're just gonna have a video or two um we're gonna go over the market quickly man i'm gonna see what's going on see if it's rising see if this see if that so i'm gonna make this video nice short and simple we're gonna go over quick snipe filters you can pause the screen we're gonna do it very quick because i'm on a time schedule i gotta go do something so we got Galaxy Open Minimum Buyout, one of the best snipers in the game. Guys, right now, it is a great time to sell your team. Great time to sell your team. Um, hopefully this team max sells. I pray to the Lords. Right now is a great time to sell. Great time to grind XP. Um, just trust me, very good time to grind XP. Um, so right now, sell your cards. I'm going to make this video nice and simple. Rip Kobe. It literally sucks. I can't believe it, bro. It sucks. One year later already, I'm getting so old. Um, but right now, guys, pretty much... All you have to do, sell your cards, period. Um, some, in, I'm obviously not the Amethyst. Um, I would keep the Amethyst for now. The Amethysts are slowly rising. I would sell your pink diamonds. I would sell your diamonds and above. Your diamonds and aboves are definitely worth the sell. Um, everything else, not really worth selling. Um, diamonds and aboves worth it. Amethyst, not so much. I think the Amethyst filter is still absolutely goaded, even though Aaron Flalo is still very, very cheap. Um, I'm looking for MPJ. I think MPJ is going to rise higher than Aaron just because he's taller. He's young. He's a rookie. He's not a rookie, but he's pretty young. Um, a lot of people love young players. They love young studs. I think he's been playing great. He just dropped 30 yesterday. So I think since his card is very hype beast, uh, his card is very hype beast. So you're going to see his price definitely rise, man. I'm a fan of him too. Uh, I, I, you just can't, you just can't not like him, you know? That's how I feel. So, I don't know. I think MPJ is definitely, definitely fire. Uh, a very, very fire. So, that's how I feel, man, to be honest with you. So, yeah, MPJ, definitely the guy you want to look out for. Um, Next up, like I said, bro, pink diamonds that just hit bay. They're, I mean, that just hit buyout are going up a lot, guys. Uh, I really hope this sells. I got it for 80K. I can make a, lot, a solid 10K. Tell, I'm, I'm telling you right now. Listen to me when I say this. If you invested in any pink diamonds that just became a bid, you're going to make so much MT. Or that just became a buyout. They went up a lot. Uh, Tracy McGrady is definitely one of them, man. Um, trust me. Trust me when I say this. Any cards that went down have went up so much MT. So any pink diamonds that you did get for around, I would say, 80 to 70 to 80K probably went up, I would say, to 20K more. Probably 10K max more. So definitely something very interesting. Uh, another filter that I've seen popping, a lot of my subs have been using it, uh, is Diamond Inferno, man. I can't believe it. I didn't think it would pop off that much, but I've seen a lot of my subs semi snipes on this filter for JR Smith. Where the heck is Diamond Inferno? Um, I can't even spell. 
Di Inferno should be right here. There we go. I keep passing it. All right, Diamond Inferno. Here we go, man. You want to look for a snipe. You're looking for J.R. Smith. DeAndre Aiden's even up in value, man. Everything's going up in value. Look at this, bro. Diamond Inferno is up big time. Last night, DeAndre Aiden was going for 48,000 MC. He's up to 58,000. Almost, he's over 60K once this one sells. So this filter right here with Mr. J.R. Smith, this is a very, very active filter. You want to pay attention to this filter. It's going to make you so much MT. Um, since now, DeAndre Ayton's up a lot. If you invest in Ayton for like 35, 40, 45K, you're going to make bank. He's at 59,000 MT. I would never expect it. He's a good card, but yo, this is a very good snipe filter. Trust me when I say this. This Ayton looking very, very nice. Not going to lie. Very, very good snipe filter right here. Um obviously bro the same thing with pink diamond inferno a very good snipe filter we got mr simmons we got mr brazingis very good cards very usable cards i know ben simmons can't shoot but if you learn how to use ben simmons he's probably one of the best point guards in the game another great snipe filter um i'm gonna go over quick badges uh i'm not like i said i'm not gonna try to make this video as long it's gonna be very short not very short decently short uh clamps bro you gotta go clamps go clamps go home man very good snipe filter especially for investing i can't believe how cheap clamps is trust me when they come out with cards that don't have clamps like op cards like let's say they drop a lebron and he doesn't have clamps something like that i don't know kevin durant something and they don't they don't have clamps you know that they're gonna release this clamps it's gonna go up in value big time same with deep threes i think i'm on next gen i don't know am i playing on next gen i can't tell deep yeah no this is actually current gen i'm on right now so Rage Extender Badge, um, also another very, very good snipe builder. So honestly, that's really all we got for the video. Just wanted to go over this quickly. I um, hope you guys did enjoy the video. Stay tuned for more content, man. Try to snipe out. Let me know what you're sniping. Have a good one. Peace.